On News 5's Blake Brown, two men rescue a shark near Perdido Key over the weekend. When a shark is spotted in the water nearby, most people would go the other way, but not Adam and his friend David. I hollered at him and I was like, what, what is that, a shark? And he's like, yeah, and he told me he had some, some type of ring around its neck, and uh, we devised a plan to try to get it ashore and get this ring off of it. These photos show a plastic pool ring around the shark's neck. Immediately, the two guys knew they needed to jump in and help. He acted kind of sickly and kept coming up to the surface and then tried to swim back down and couldn't. So it looked like he was needing some help. Um, he was swimming around for a good 45 minutes before we actually were able to catch him. Uh, he started beating himself on the, on the shore. So we got some pliers and some other stuff and was able to get him and help him out. The pliers weren't working. That's when David began pulling and stretching the ring until he was able to loosen it enough to slide it off. The hardest part was getting the shark to calm down so nobody got bit. Uh, you know, obviously there's kids and other things out there and the shark's panicking. The two guys suspect the ring was around the shark's neck for quite a while. And it had done pretty significant damage to its around its neck. They're just glad they were in the right place at the right time. I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.